AI is only getting better and better. Can it be a GeoGuessr Pro at GeoGuessr? If you guys don't know, ChatGPT4 just released ChatGPT4 Vision, which basically allows you to upload any image and ChatGPT4 Vision will analyze it and answer any question you might have around the image. Today, I'm gonna 1v1 ChatGPT4 Vision to see if it can analyze the image and make a better guess than myself in GeoGuessr and see who will win. Let's do it. Okay, so round one here is pretty obvious and I can get a pretty close score here. I don't know what ChatGPT4 Vision, how good it is, or what it's gonna analyze in this photo. I'm gonna ask it to give me context on everything, but immediately here, we're gonna be the Netherlands because of the yellow backplate language, everything like that. I think ChatGPT4 Vision will get this, but I'm just gonna say Netherlands because it is pretty standard and was just north of Amsterdam. So basically, I just screenshotted that round and put it into ChatGPT4 and I'm gonna ask it, you are an expert in geography, terrain, landscapes, flora, fauna, and more. Using expert reasoning, please predict which country this photo was taken. And let's just see what it knows and what it guesses here. I know it's Amsterdam, I already got it right, but can ChatGPT4 also guess the road tennis place says Dutch. Okay, so it's reading, so it's Netherlands. It's using public information like searching. Kind of cheating, if you must say so myself. Kind of cheeto. The road signs and traffic features resemble those commonly found in Europe, particularly the Netherlands. That's true. That Those are Dutch. The floor, including the water canal seen on the right. Wow, it actually picked up the water canals on the right. What the heck? It is right about the Netherlands. Okay. Once I get more rural rounds, I think I can. I might thrive. All right, so this is a GPT-4 account. So I guess Netherlands. So we're pretty much one for one. I slightly guess closer for ChatGPT there, but that's okay. All right, round two. Can I get it? Ooh, this will be a fun one. Okay, this will be very hard. I think this is Latvia or Estonia or one of the Baltic countries. I would probably go Estonia here with this gravel road and these white flowers probably. Yeah, I'm gonna go Estonia. It could be really any of the Baltics though. It was Estonia. All right, I don't know what GPT-4 Vision is gonna go here, but let's find out. I use the same prompt and uh, we have the same painting of the image. This image is a bit more challenging. In the previous one. Okay, so it's using context from the previous one, so it's gonna build off context. So I wonder if it benefits or if it thinks it's gonna be Europe because of that. Okay, it's analyzing clues. Screen vegetation landscape is flat with grasslands and patches of dense forest. The vegetation seems to be temperate. True, the sky is pretty cloudy, which is indicate. Oh, it's using the sky. Okay, the gravel road is, is a good clue. The home feature many rural areas around the world. The white arrows on the road. Oh no, it's using the street view arrows. Oh no, GPT-4, you dummy. The landscape has a Northern European or North American feel to it, but it's a bit generic and potentially be varies from country in those regions. Without distinct landmarks, culture or clues, it's challenging to pinpoint the exact country. It could be somewhat in Northern Europe, like Sweden, Denmark, Finland, or the Baltic countries, or perhaps part of Canada or Northern US. However, this is a great general estimation and the exact country can't be definitely determined by the image alone. Please guess a country. You cannot be nuanced here, Mr. ChatGPT4. AI is not taking my job, basically is what it's saying. Unless the guess is Estonia here. Okay, given the landscape, vegetation, and the general feel, Sweden. L plus ratio. Okay, it's not over yet though, it's not over. I do not think you get the pull of that pull in Sweden. Also, without distinct landmarks, culture, or clues, it's challenging to pinpoint the exact country. Not really, bucko. Not really. It's going Sweden here. So I'll make a, I'll make a guess on Sweden. I'll give it, you know, Southern Sweden. You know, get it some points here on the board. All right, next round here. Looks like it's going to be Spain immediately. These road lines are weird with the dash hour lines. I mean, you see these in like Estonia and uh, I don't know if I've ever even seen these in Spain to be honest, but like this vegetation feels so Mediterranean in Spanish that I have to go to Spain here. Uh, I'll go somewhere like this. What a great guess. So, so far I'm doing pretty well. ChatGPT, will it get Spain here? I don't know. I honestly don't know. It's kind of um, falling a little behind here, okay? All right, so I got Spain, but can ChatGPT4 also pick up Spain here? I don't know. If it's getting the right vibes here, it's, it's gonna be interesting. I think it'll get the Mediterranean feel, but I'm not too sure what exactly it's gonna, it's gonna think. Typical Mediterranean or timber climates, under, undergrowth shows some struggle, some drought resistant shrubs and plants. Road, the road is a bit worn with an evident asphalt surface, it has a European style road, true. Nature vegetation is supposed to region that has a warm possible Mediterranean climate. Is it gonna get it? The landscape characterized by evergreen trees and shrubs along with dry looking ground suggests a Mediterranean region. Considering all these clues, this photograph could have been taken in one of the countries in the Mediterranean region. Region, where it's typing in circles, we know it's Mediterranean. Vegetation and general appearance of landscapes ruining the some areas of Spain, southern France, or even parts of Italy. However, the most consistent match, in my opinion, would be Spain. Wow. Okay. What region of Spain? Let's give it. Let's give it a little region guess here, shall we? Given the landscape and vegetation in the photograph. The trees and shrubs okay, present it's a little spill again. Junk. It's reminiscent of regions in southeastern or central Spain. Okay, okay. Is it southeastern or central? That's like, that's pretty impressive, not gonna lie. But this is also pretty easy. It's gonna be South Africa and like southern region. I don't know if it's gonna know this, bro. Like it could easily go Australia or something here. Pretty easy South Africa with these hills. I would probably go somewhere down here. You know, again, it could be somewhere near Lesotho. Uh, it cannot be in Lesotho because we have Gen 2 camera. But these like hills are kind of distinctive to Lesotho. But I still think it's gonna be somewhat southernish near Cape on, on the southern coast here. And let's see. 
It was just near Lesotho. Okay, the AI has opportunity to pick up some points here because it looked so Lesotho to me. I don't know why I did that, but that's okay. I kind of blundered that one and left it some room for improvements. Let's see if the GPT-4 can pick it up. The land is flat with some low hills in the distance. It says Southern Africa, especially in the more interior parts from the away from the coast areas like Free State, Northwest, or parts of the Northern Cape. I'm not gonna lie, dude, it said Free State, which Free State is, I'm 90% sure of this state right here, which is where it is. I'll put an image on the screen of Free State, and it, I mean, it called it, dude. It actually called it. I called it too, but that's okay. All right, next round. Is this, I gotta lock in. I gotta sit up, fix my posture. I think this will be Greece. It could be Bulgaria, like somewhere over here, though, so I'm gonna guess north. Okay. The, those double white road lines with the uh, wooden poles in the distance made me think Greece with the vegetation. Pretty good guess. You know, we're calling Northern Greece there, and I kind of needed that. I needed that little confidence boost. The real question is, will GPT-4 be able to know the road lines and be able to make a distinct enough guess here? It already picked up points in South Africa, but it's like blundered. I'm not sure why it uses the sky. If there's like sky meta that's like untapped in GeoGuessr, that's game over. I don't think there is though, <laughs> but it's kind of cool. It's using vegetation. Yeah, I mean like this vegetation makes sense for like North Mass Serbia, like that type of thing. Why am I nervous, bro? I'm actually nervous. It's like it's like I'm testing my like future employer. France L L plus ratio L plus ratio hungry L plus ratio Poland. This is never Poland. Actually, it could be. Let's go, bro. You're so bad. I would lean towards France, particularly the northern. Bro, those are never French road lines. Holy f AI is so dumb. You thought you're gonna take my job? Uh huh. Ratio. Just kidding. Particularly in the northern or central regions, which is known for extensive agri. Yeah. Okay. Bro, I thought it was northern France. That's sad. And bro went Sweden on Estonia. Rematch, Boza. L. All right, game one, I've won, and I could have gotten a lot better if I just like trusted my gut on calling the Lesotho Hills there. But all in all, I'll take that game of mine for NMPZ. And also, I'm pretty impressed by the guesses and the reasoning behind GPT-4 there. So let's do one more game and see if I can go two for two or if job application, because I might be uh, might be needing that. Let's see, let's see. All right, game two, what the heck is this? Is this New Zealand? But this is not easy. I'm just gonna instance in New Zealand. If this isn't New Zealand, I'm not sure what it could be. It could be somewhere in the weird in the US, but I think it's like somewhere like over here. Okay, it was just Christchurch. Okay, that's fine. The question is, does ChatGPT4 go New Zealand on that? I'm not sure, to be honest. It's just a random road with trees. I really don't think GPT4 is gonna be able to get New Zealand here. Like, maybe I'm underestimating it. Like, we'll like scan the trees and like know where the trees are from and things like that. The ferns are a good hint that's in New Zealand too. So that's already a good sign, actually. I'm actually kind of nervous. Can we talk about how big of a yapper GPT is? Like, it actually, like, it actually suggests I was looking at the copyright. Copyright meta, OP, okay. Seen in parts of UK. Oh, please go UK here. I will take that. So it's never UK. Ooh, New Zealand, especially North Island. Thank you for validating me. Certain regions in the Pacific Northwest of the USA. Maybe I could see like an Oregon here. Parts of Ireland. Mm, the road does not look like an Irish road. I mean, all of the ones it's saying kind of makes sense, but not really. A more definitive identification would require more specific details for landmark terms, but not really. Not really. Yours bad. Yours bad. Upless ratio. Please identify a single country. I mean, it has UK at number one, so just Scotland or Wales. If it somehow it switches to New Zealand. New Zealand. Hold this ratio. It did say North Island, guys. It said North Island, especially in North Island. So why would it rank parts of the UK such as Scotland or Wales number one and then ended up switching it, bro? It's actually playing mind games on me, dude. It's actually playing mind games. I'll just guess like near where I did. Okay, round two. This is the fully loaded image in Norway, but there's no way the ChatGPT is going to be able to see through the blurry image, right? Is this a human advantage already? Like I'm able to identify through blurriness or is that something they're going to pick up on as well? I'm going to go somewhere north of Bergen here, maybe somewhere over here. It was just Tron time. I don't know if it's gonna be able to do this. We'll see though, we'll see. It's still being able to pick up the hills and stuff. And there is a sign, it's getting near up. Why am I nervous? My best guess would be Norway. Which part of Norway? Watch this 5K. Put the meme of the, um... I'm actually f All right, so this is Vestland. Okay, I think Vestland's like over here by Bergen, right? Uh, I'm just gonna guess over here where it said. So I pick up points there, that's good. It was still a pretty good guess. I'm surprised he got it through the blurriness, to be honest. Like, so far, these are have not been easy rounds. And we have a Brazil, a Southern Brazil. I'm just going to instance in Southern Brazil. Um, maybe somewhere dryish near Sao Paulo. Oh, I'm nervous. Maybe more south. Okay. It was just Sao Paulo. That's a pretty good guess for my Brazil. All right, let's see if it gets Brazil, specifically Southern Brazil here near the Sao Paulo region. I probably should have seen this in Sao Paulo. These round poles are more commonly found in the south and there's black in the back of the sun, which indicates Brazil. That's how I knew. Fences divide the landscape. These fences are found in like Colombia, Brazil, and Mexico. It says South America, specifically the grasslands, Brazil, Paraguay, and Argentina. Not bad. My best guess would be Brazil. Dude, what the f man? 
go like northeast with how dry it is in this landscape. Please, I just need big points. I just need big points. I'm nervous, bro. Like it's I feel like I'm like the AI is like actually taking my job. <laughs> Central West region. See what it ends up choosing here. It's the same Matagrosso, Matagrosso, Soul, and Goyos. Those are kind of similar. Goyos is kind of far. It's going Matagrosso, the Soul. I'll give it the closer guess. But we'll give it the benefit of the doubt. Because it did say it's out low. I'm not gonna lie, this is like a very close game in round four right now in Iceland. It's freaking gonna get Iceland, dude, and I don't want to reach against Iceland. I'm not gonna read this sign, but they're gonna read this and know where this is, and I don't. So I'm gonna sit here and scan for it. There's no water west, though, is a problem. I don't know. My best guess is somewhere over here. Okay, there's more west. I'm still getting a pretty good guess there, and I think it'll get Iceland here. It's pretty easy. Iceland with the yellow bollards and the landscape. It could go like Svalbard or like Faroe Islands, maybe. I'm gonna need to region guess. I hope he just goes Reykjavik or somewhere east. Dude, I'm like, actually, if I, I do not want to lose to the AI, bro, I really don't. Of course, it's reading. Specifically, it's in the Dalla Big Minute. He just guessed the region, right? Get rolled, nerd. It guessed the region right this is the final round i have 16,629 points and the ai has 16,479 points it comes down to this and i know this is going to be lithuania thankfully i don't think it gets lithuania i really don't think it gets lithuania guys and i'm gonna go just central and get the most points 21 three that's a good score okay it needs a near perfect guess here to win. I saw the A-frame pulls in the distance that were Lithuanian. There was Lithuanian bollards. The road lines here might throw it for the loop because these are more common in France and Norway and things like that. Very rare in Lithuania, kind of. But let's see, it might get Baltics in Lithuania and make a good guess. I'm gonna try and get it to guess like the coordinates on this just to make it as fair as possible. Please go like France or like Greece or something, bro. Please. Denmark, Sweden, or the Netherlands come to mind. Yes! AI is fucking trash, and I'm the goat, and I will forever have a job, and you will never take my job, AI, you piece of sh**. Yeah, that's right, you went Denmark. Oh my god, bro thought Lithuania was Denmark. That's tragic. L plus ratio, you're not taking my job, bucko, okay? 19,000, you can't get 20k, okay? You can't get 20k, that's kind of embarrassing. And you're actually probably transcribing my videos to learn things about this game anyway, so it's okay, you know, ratio. All right, before the video ends, I wanna try one more thing with ChatGPT4 Vision to test really how good it is. I have a Discord with all my GeoGuessr friends and like other professional GeoGuessr pro players where we have a channel called Where Do You Go, where we send the hardest locations on Street View and everyone has to guess basically where they think it is. And this one right here sent by Macum six, eight months ago was probably one of the hardest ones that we've ever struggled on. And I wanna see how well it thrives when we don't. If you see here, we had a Luxembourg, Czechia, Japan, Belgium, Canada, I went Slovenia, Germany, Denmark, Latvia, Sweden, Russia, Mexico, Taiwan, Chile. No one knows where this is. Eventually, we went through like almost every country and Simon guessed Eswatini, where it is. And I thought, what better way to really test it than to see where it goes and to see who is validated here in their guess. Let's find out where ChatGPT4 Vision goes on one of the hardest locations I think I've ever seen. We'll be very, very surprised and very impressed if it's able to get a good region guess here. Because this looks nothing like Eswatini at all. This is such a distinct, like, non-Eswatini round. Yes, it's true on that, I think. On the pathway. I just really hope it doesn't go Eswatini because that'd be a, kind of a bad look. North America like USA or Canada. True. Northern Europe like Sweden, Finland, Estonia, true. or Latvia. Or even Asia like Japan could have such landscapes. Wow, it doesn't even guess South Africa here at all. Or Southern Africa. Or guess Africa is even an option here. Yeah, see, this is validated. All right. It's not that good, okay? It's not getting a random rural Eswatini round. I just wanted to make sure. Because if it got that, that would have been um, a bad look for the GSR community as a whole. Maybe this will get better over the next couple months. And um, I have no job. If you guys want to see me dual ChatGPT4 vision again, let me know. I personally was kind of scared. And still kind of impressed how good it is. But it's not good enough. I'm still better. I still know a lot more than it. We'll see. See how it progresses over the next couple months. But if you guys enjoyed this, leave a like, subscribe, or don't. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.